let's just be a little countercultural here for a second, shall we? Never mind the pet peeves. What are your pet loves? Hello everybody. Man in the West here. And this is a game called Stardew Valley. Now here in England it can be quite a negative culture sometimes. Oh look at the queues, look at the rain, blah 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 blah, yeah, 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 yeah. But sometimes it's really great to think about those things that we love, those little things in life that make us smile and just give us that little positive feeling. And I'm not talking about the big headline things like a sunset or hearing a great tune or something like that, I mean. People talk about that all the time. Please comment down below. Tell me some of the things that you love that make you smile. That maybe don't get quite the headlines they deserve. So I'm going to start off with... You know when it's been raining and you get that a little bit of oil maybe that's built into a puddle. And then it creates this metallic shimmer that's rainbow coloured. It's all like hippie and tie-dyed and stuff. It's kind of bittersweet because it means that something nasty like oil is being spilled out. And that's a bit of a shame, but the effect it creates is so gorgeous, I think. On the subject of rain, this leads me on to my second pet love. That's when it, you're safe and warm inside, but it's raining and hurling it down outside. And you don't have anywhere to be. You can just chill out and listen to it. It's such a great, gorgeous sound. I really love it when it's heavy, thick rain that's coming straight down, sort of spring rain. That's, ah, oh, so relaxing. It reminds me of a time, I think it all goes back to when I was a teenager and a bunch of us, we hired out a space. Um, it was our church hall, I think, and we just spent the New Year's there, just the bunch of us just hanging out, laughing, playing games, being silly. So good, such a good time. And then at about four in the morning, we decided to call it a night and I got a lift back with a guy called Andy and the roads were all clear, it was so quiet. Got back into bed and just sat there listening to the rain fall down gently onto the, onto the extension outside my window. I was all happy from spending time with friends, I was tired, easy, so easy to get to sleep and just lying there listening to that peaceful rain, it was so lush. Number three, I really love it when you're waiting for a train and the train arrives and the door is exactly where you are standing. That is such a good feeling. It's especially good on those commuter trains where you can't shotgun a seat and it's first come first served and that's usually quite stressful I find that quite stressful but then when it when the changes arise exactly where you are you're like yes seat guaranteed back of the net ah. you know it's so good to think about these little things that make us smile so what are your thoughts guys? What are those little things that make you smile that you appreciate that doesn't always get the headline treatment it maybe deserves? So thank you very much for watching. This has been the first of my new series. I hope you've enjoyed it and I can't wait to hear what you have to say. See you next time.